Welcome back guys to a brand new video on the channel. Now today we're going to be going through every single confirmed creature that is coming to the Extinction DLC in 5 days time, November the 6th. I am getting so hyped for Extinction now, it's getting closer and closer and closer. So I thought I would just let you guys know in one whole video every single creature that you can expect and whether it's tameable or rideable. Before we get into today's video, as always, if you guys wouldn't mind smashing a like on today's video, if we could try and hit over 500 likes, that would be absolutely amazing. And make sure to be subscribed as well, because as I said, Extinction is five days away and there's going to be all the videos that you guys need and like tutorials and stuff for the Extinction DLC of a new series that I've been talking about for a while. But anyway, let's get straight into this. And as you will see on your screen, the first one we're talking about, which I won't talk about too much because it's been around a lot longer than the other ones, is the Enforcer. Now, the Enforcer is going to be a new tech creature added in to the Extinction DLC. This was one of the first things we ever saw when the trailer was first announced for Extinction. It was the um, crazy sort of drone thing that attacked, uh, well, tech creature that attacked the uh, Giga, as you guys can see here. It will be tameable and it will be rideable, and that is going to be something that you guys can expect to see throughout. It most likely will be through the Corrupted City, which is like the great city it's called on the map. So that is going to be exciting. I'm looking forward to that. We've not we've known about this one for the longest, so we'll hopefully find out some more information we probably won't find out any more information now anyway until the full game is here but that's when you know you guys will want to be on the channel where i'm doing reviews of dinos how to spawn them in and everything like that so the next one we're going to be talking about is the Gapcha. Now this is a giant sloth and it will be coming with the Extinction DLC. This is tameable and it is rideable so you guys will be able to do that. If you haven't seen the trailer I have uploaded this on my uh, um, on, on my channel but if not that you know you can go onto the Ark channel to see all the trailers of the brand new um dinos and creatures and stuff coming this is going to like give you some sort of gems which we don't know what those gems are going to be used for at the moment but you can give it stuff and it gives you gems and it's, it's really exciting so i'm hoping the sloth is going to have some, you know a big part of the game and not be boring now the next thing is what I am most excited for and again you can watch the trailer on my channel or on Arc's channel as well. This is the gas bag. I've been talking about the gas bag on the channel now for a very very long time. You guys will most likely would have seen the trailer now. So hyped for this. You're going to be able to fly with these gas bags off into the air. They also can fight off things like raptors by using some weird sort of poison that scares them off which I cannot wait to use. I feel like this is going to be one of the most exciting and new creatures and again as always i'll be showing you guys how to do everything it is tameable and it is rideable and uh, you can fly off into the air with it so the next one we are going to be talking about is something I am not going to be able to say the name of, but the Managama. I'm going to go with the Managama or something like that. That's the closest I'm going to get to this. These are the new small dragons that are going to be in the Extinction DLC, and you guys can see the picture here. Right now, it's not known if they're rideable. They're tameable. On the wiki, it says not rideable, and I think the reason behind that is because these are actually very, very small um, like dragons and stuff so it's going to be interesting to find out um, if, if they're going to be rideable or not I don't think they will and I don't know if there's they've got the other picture here they might not but we'll come um, you guys would have seen it on my channel anyway but really really looking forward to see these new mini dragons and or, and you know this um, is a is the mysterious mysteries for it if you guys want to have a closer look at these new awesome dragons because I feel like they're going to be very useful and nice pets to have around now the next thing is the Scout Drone. Now again, this is something we've talked about for a very long time. This was in the trailer of the Extinction DLC. I'm sure you guys would have seen that. It's got like 2 million views now, the Extinction DLC trailer. Um, and uh, this is going to be something you can use from some sort of tech binoculars. Now, it probably most likely won't be tech binoculars. And the reason for that is because that will just take way too long to get up to if you're someone new on a server. Um, so it's just probably going to be some binoculars that you can create. Don't know how hard it is going to be to do, but you're going to be able to get them. And I am so hyped to be able to try out these scouts. You can craft them or you can tame them from what I know. I could be wrong there. Um, it says they're not 
not tameable and they're not rideable, but you can craft them. That's 100% to let you guys know there from other parts, because I know you have to fight other scouts around, and when you destroy them, you can collect the parts to create your own scout drone. Make sure to use it wisely. Do not waste it. In five days' time, as I've said plenty of times in this video, there will be so many videos talking about how to use all the different dinos and show, showing you guys how to use the scout drone as well. Moving on to the next thing is the Snow Owl. Now, again, this was leaked in if you want um, in one of the vid uh, videos on my channel. If you guys want to um, go onto my channel and look back and uh, look at some extinction teasers and stuff, you can see a closer look at the owl. It's more like the size of an RG. I know in this picture it looks like it's going to be... Um, it looks like it's going to be a shoulder mount or something. It doesn't look that, that big, but it is actually going to be huge. Most likely tameable. Most, well, definitely tameable. Most likely rideable because you guys, if you've seen that leaked, well, uh, a revealed picture by Wildcard, it is a pretty huge dino. Uh, well, we'd say more creature animal. Um, so, yeah, no, really looking forward to the owl. I don't know the difference it's going to have compared to the RG because they look very similar in the pictures, but we'll see more about that. Now, I don't want to move on to that advert there. That's thank you, Wildcard, and your wiki for moving for trying to make some advert load up halfway through the video. But anyway, moving on to the next one, which is the Velenosaur. This was recently revealed in a new trailer, and it is a new carnivore, uh, which I'm excited about. It's tameable and it is rideable, and you need to get the Vel Velenosaur um, saddle. And if you guys didn't know, this is actually going to be ha you have machine guns. You can actually put a saddle on it to use machine guns coming from its head now I'm gonna go on to the picture of it right now it's that is an awful photo that we've been provided there but if you guys do want to check out this picture or the full gameplay of the Velenosaur then you guys can do that on the Ark Survival Evolve YouTube channel but yes a new carnivore looks crazy I'm so excited about it and we'll see more about that very soon now moving on to the next thing is we're just going to be quickly going through these, which is the Titans. So we've got the Desert Titan, we've got the Forest Titan, we've got the Frost Titan, and we have the Sky Titan. Now, um, the reason why I went through those uh, quickly because you may have seen that photo that was shown at TwitchCon, and I'm gonna if you haven't, then I'm gonna be showing it on the screen right now. This is all the Titans coming to the game. Um, just to let you guys know, the Frost Titan is the one you would have seen in the trailer. But now I'm just going to quickly go and find that picture for you, which um, here it is. This is the one we needed. No, we've scrolled past it too much. It's a very laggy thing. Um, but yeah, this is one of the one of the pictures we wanted. This is showing off the Desert Titan. So on your screen, you will see a Desert Titan, which is this one here. That's the Velenosaur, and you also see a new huge like robot man. He's not going to be a Titan, but it's some. Something that I have no one has any idea where it's going to come into place but help you fight against the big titans on the DLC and I'm hoping somewhere along these lines I'll be able to show you well no I will 100% be able to show you the picture um, this one here is of the forest titan this this has been going around for ages this is the forest titan right here we've also got the frost titan you guys would have seen this hundred millions of times from the trailer um, as you guys can see there and then the sky titan again another one which hopefully they've shown us the picture here no they haven't shown us the picture i want to show you guys i'll get back to that in a second but this is the giant sky titan um and then now going on to the official extinction page this is everything which is coming which would most likely have been from the other dlcs and everything but before i go through all of them i want to see if i can find that picture for all of you because i know they have the videos on here as well i know a lot of you guys are going to want to see see it so hopefully wildcard don't let me down yes this is the one i was looking for so actually there's a better one but we'll look at this one and then we'll look at the other one afterwards so that's the sky titan that's the frost titan that's the forest titan and again that is the desert Titan. And there's a corrupted rock drake there, which I do not want to be coming against one of them. I know I'm going to have to, but they're going to be crazily powerful, I can just tell. From what I've been told as well... The corrupted dinos and creatures and stuff are meant to be very, very powerful. Like some people who actually tried out the Extinction DLC have told me that they find it way too OP. So hopefully that isn't the case. I really, really don't want that to be the case. I want it to be 
pro like amazing so no one gets very frustrated or too frustrated for it and this is the official art of extinction that i wanted to show you because i think this looks absolutely crazy um and then hopefully we can we get closer i don't think we can oh there we go that is what i wanted so look at that guys the official art for the extinction dlc the frost titan looks crazy for me the desert titan is going to be my favorite and um, i'm excited to tame the air titan actually and fly through the skies with that huge huge beast um, I think that might be an enforcer there as well and another one's at the tail of an enforcer there so pretty crazy stuff so before I do end the video, as I said, I would quickly go through every single confirmed creature that is coming to Extinction from the other maps as well. Don't worry if there isn't something on there straight away. There may be a chance that other things will be added in, but most likely this is going to be the fully confirmed list of things coming to Extinction. So we've got the Attack Drone, the Bronto, the Kano and the Alpha Kano, the Corrupted Kano, that's been revealed, the Beavers these guys which I can never say the name of I'm sorry but I just never can um, and the corrupted version of it you guys have been to see on the screen defense units death worms and alpha death worms have actually been confirmed which I think this all of the best ones are coming to the map and that's why I'm so hyped about it we've got the corrupted death worm as I said as well as so there's three of them um, the, the, the dillos they've got to be there and the corrupted dillos Dimorphodons, Diabez, Galleys, Gigas. Now, there is going to be a Giga and a Corrupted Giga. Now, I um, I don't know how crazy that's going to be, but that is going to be one hell of, well, one massive fight. Um, we've also got the Lystrosaurus, as always, or the Lystrosaurus, whatever you guys want to call it. Um, a Mammoth, a Parasaur, a Corrupted version of it, a, a Parasaur, and a Tech Parasaur. So the Tech ones will be joining us. A Tyrannodon and a Corrupted Tyrannodon, Quetzal, Tech Quetzal, Raptor, Tech Raptor, Alpha Raptor, and Corrupted Raptor, and also Rex, Tech Rex, Alpha Rex, and Corrupted Rex. So lots of stuff of those different types there. Rock Drakes and the Corrupted Rock Drake, as you guys saw earlier. Sabertooth Salmon, Sarco, Spinosaur, Corrupted Spino, Stego, Tech Stego, Corrupted Stego, Tape Jara, Therizino, and the Corrupted Version. Trike, Corrupted Trike, Wyvern, Alpha Wyvern, and the Corrupted Wyvern. So things have been changed as it gets closer and closer. So if there isn't a dino that is, you know, if, there, if there's a dino on there that you didn't see, um, well, that you don't see and you want it there, there's a small chance it'll be added. But what Wildcard did confirm to us is that every single dino won't be joining us. They wanted to pick the ones they thought was, you know, that suited the map best. And they've, I think they've kind of picked all of the best ones. I know there are some missing, but the main, if you're wondering, as well why there's no aquatic ones there i know there's the sarco but it's because there's not really that much water on the extinction dlc anyway guys that is the full video which i hope it has helped you out today every single confirmed dino and creature and tech creature coming for the extinction dlc five days to go guys the hype is really on now i cannot wait there's going to be so so many videos coming your way on extinction so make sure to be subscribed and have those notifications turned on leave a like if you did enjoy and i'll catch you guys in my next video see you guys later